Yes, uh, VIP VIP na kabla kwenye another episode. Uh, this is episode 67 and hope you are doing fine. Hope mamkafiti maze na karibu tena kwenye this episode ambapo tunaenda tukupitia analysis and previews. Uh, siku ya leo iko ni siku ya tarehe 2 mwezi Novemba mwaka 2024. Yaani siku ya Thursday maze. Uh, so uh, kwenye episode 67 tunaangalia tu zile analysis ambapo in this episode umeweza ku realize kwamba moja kwa moja kwamba Tito ana revenge maze kile ambacho beki walimfanyia na nani na dadake Morin kule upande wa ghetto niposa uh, Tito anajaribu kumfanyia beki at uh, this time round maamua manze kama ni mbaya mbaya kumbuka beki alienda moja kwa moja kumuomba msamaha manze na kumuomba another chance ambapo uh, alikuwa uh, ana feel guilty she's feeling guilty so aliona uh, eri la wama imeondokea na hizi mangori zote aenda afanye nini aombe Tito msamaha but kufika kule manze huyu jamaa Njamaa miwaka, njamaa mikataa kumsamehea mazee. Amesema ah ah, nyinyi mko na daka, tuwe na dada yako Morin kitu mlinifanyia. Na by the way kitu Beki na Morin walinifanyia nyeo hiyo kitu na si kitu mzuri. Kumbuka the time Tito alikuwa amepiga magoti akiomba msamaha manzi akiambia Beki amsamehe and all that. Morin hadi anachukua maji kwa ndoa anamuogesha na. So at this time ni wakati Tito ni wakati sasa Beki amkuja kupiga magoti. But who is Tito? Hmm? What goes around what comes around goes around uh, or all this kitu kama so atito uh, amwambia manze we mi hiyo iwezekani nyinyi mlinitreat vibaya na mlifanya size na shinda nime teseka in this life so uh, the best thing you can do ni kutoka tu hapa kabla kikuwe kibaya beki analia manze anapiga magoti analia analia ameshika huyu tito lakini tito anataka hata kumwekelea vitu anamwambia manze toka hapa hivi kabla kabla ni kufanyia kitu yenye hujai fanyio eh hmm? So I uh, in this episode you will see just uh, Tito uh, na ni revenging eh? ameamua eh manze mimi kitu ulinifanyia pia mimi lazima ule dhani itafika siku yako imefika and also in this episode ndipo sasa tunakuja kugundua kwamba uh, this girl Alexis manze kumbe Alexis all this long ni mtoto wake nani madhakatana eh guess what Alexis ni mtoto wake madhakatana and inajulikana aje remember the time Alexis anamuliza Tito uh, mbona watu walikugonga na gari hiyo time uh, mbona ungeza kuwapeleka mbio mbio mbona ungeenda huko kwenye mansion uwaekelee manze niposa Tito anamwambia manze beki alikuwa anafanya kazi huko that time sasa mimi sikutaka kwenda huko kusababisha otherwise otherwise ingekuwa ingekuwa different ningeenda huko ningesababisha mbaya sana ongi ni ongi ongi nichezea hivi vinyo walinifanyia Manze Tito anasema kwamba angeenda huko angesababisha. Na anawaambia lakini one day, one day one time, hii familia ya Mother Katana, the, the Katana's family watakuja kujionea. Ndipo sasa uh, Alexis anaposikia Tito akisema, "Hatumesema nani? Uh, nimesema Katana's family, this Katana's family or this siju watu wanajiita siju the Katana's or what? Hao watu ni watiaji na ni wasoro. Siku moja watakuja ku regret in this life." Ndipo sasa Alexis anashtuka Manze. At Katana Yes exactly tena anamwambia manze nimesema katana kwani unawajua au inakushtua but Alex anashtuka anamwambia hebu ngoje kidogo mtu mwenye alikuwa ananilea aliniambia sometimes back kwamba uh, mimi ni mzaliwa wa katana's family walai tito anamuuza walai lakini sasa shida ni ati hauna evidence but Alex anamwambia wewe tulia who are this katana nimekuwa nikishikutafuta niki, niki hao watu wanaitwa katana all this long nikitafuta this katana's family Manze si sijawahi jua ah ni watu wa gani hao ndio unaniambia ndio wenye najua sasa leo niposa tisho anamwambia manze hao ni wale wajiru wake beki wenye wali mistreat wakampiga vibaya sana so uh, niposa Alexis anatoka moja kwa moja na mwacha Tito Tito anajaribu kumuita eh hey, Alexis come but Alexis anaenda moja kwa moja kule kwenye maskani anaenda kuchukua uh, akona na picture ambayo ilikuwa imekaanga na alikuwa amepewa na huyo huyo mlezi wake before dead kuna mlezi alikuwa na mlea ambapo huyo ni she, i think alikuwa amemuadopt tu So huyo mlezi ndiye alimwambia anga wewe ulizaliwa kwenye Katana family wenye hivi sasa siju I don't know kama alimpea full information about those Katana family but Alex anapoendea picture anapata ni picture yake nani Martha Katana So anapomuonesha Tito anamwambia si huyu ndio Katana ndipo sasa Tito anashtuka anasema ye iki kimama manze iki kimama kilikata kunikanja do zangu iki So ndio Alex anamwambia manze mimi niliambiwa kwamba mimi ni mtoto wa huyu madhe What Sema maajabu sema Tito kujipata kwenye another coincidence ambapo sasa mumzigo imekuwa mzito. Kumbuka Tito nao is fighting Katana's family at the same time kumbe tena anaishi na Katana's family. Hmm? So Alex Manze baada hapo hivyo kumbe ni ana realize kwamba that huyo ndio mama yake Manze 
anambia tito moja kwa moja ampeleke. So uh, wanalala usiku ambapo inafaa the following day tito ampeleke kwenye katana sa familia jue hawa watu. But inafika the following day tito manza na katana sema ya hezi enda uko. Haezi manze. Anasema hawa watu ni watu wengine hatari ya hezi enda uko. Na ulikuwa sha panga na Alexis kwamba atampeleka moja kwa moja hadi uko kuona the katana sa familia. But tito amekataa manze. Anasema haa hezi hiyo iwezi. Ya yeah, uweza hezi enda kuna kaa. So actually guys in this episode what we are just saying kwamba Tito ana revenge back and also uh, the truth is that Alexis ni mtoto wake nani? Mother Katana. Ni mtoto wake mother na ni dada yake Sally at the same time ni dada yake nani? Junior. So uh, guys this is what is happening in this episode. Remember subscribe, like and uh, turn on notification bell. 